Okay, so if you've never seen Evangelion, basically uh, there are these giant monsters called angels, right? So these angels, or, you know, whatever you want to call them, they go and they attack Japan. It takes place in the future. And, you know, these monsters are huge. So, like, uh, you know, Godzilla style, they're knocking over buildings. They basically just obliterate everything, okay? You know, some pretty, some pretty heavy stuff. So uh, then the humans, they got these things called, you know, Evas. And basically these are just giant robots. And they, you know, they pilot these giant robots to go fight the angels, okay? Pretty standard stuff. Very easy to understand, okay? All you basically need to know is there are giant monsters and there are humans and robots fighting them. Now these monsters, the angels, they have incredible destructive power. They can knock over buildings, they can uh, kill thousands if not millions of people, they can destroy countless lives. That being said, allowing an angel to do this would be incredibly morally irresponsible. And because of which, the job of actually having to pilot one of those giant robots is pretty much the biggest ethical and military responsibility that one person could ever possibly have. Who do they entrust with this responsibility? Children! Children! That is the most impractical thing I've ever heard. That makes zero sense. Nobody on this show at any point said to themselves, hey, this is kind of important. Maybe we should have an adult do this. Now I asked a friend of mine why they have children drive the robots and she said cuz for some reason only children who were born in 2000 that war disaster thing are able to pilot it and then furthermore she goes on to say I know why it's only kids that were born during the second impact that are able to pilot the EVAs I don't think they ever really explained it in the show this is Shinji He's 14. He has no military training. And uh, he's emo. This is who's protecting us. Also, look how wide his forehead is and how far apart his eyeballs are. Clearly he has Down syndrome. There are adults building these giant robots. At no point did they think to themselves, Hey, let's just make it so an adult can drive this uh, giant robot. But no, we get Shinji. We get this little nitwit. Oh, I'm sad about stuff. I'm emo. Oh, I don't want to drive a giant robot. I'm too sad to drive the giant robot. <sighs> I do not want the future of my society and the safety of my family entrusted to a child who's emo. Anime sucks. <laughs>